بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم ما بعد أيها الأحبة there's no doubt that we're all aware of many of the sins that we commit and we're all aware that we need to come back to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But how to get there? All those obstacles, some of us, it's our desires alone. Our own inner self is preventing us. It's like a, a wall and you're striving to get somewhere, striving to get to good, but you're being prevented by that barrier of your desires. And some of us, it's our surroundings. We can't seem to remove ourselves from being immersed with the people of Khubh, with Khabaith, you know, the Shayateen from the mankind, from men in jinn, or the Shayateen from uh, the male and the female Shayateen. So, whatever the case may be, we all realize we have to come back to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and we need to come closer to Allah. And this brings up a very important point. Letting us know that all of us have shortcomings. All of us have sins. That not only you're going through your struggle with whatever sins that you can't s seem to be, have difficulty shaking or, or, or getting past or making toba from them, repenting to Allah, but letting us know that everyone, their iman, our iman fluctuates, it goes up and down. And sometimes we're strong, sometimes we're weak in faith. And that our Iman or our faith is on different levels as well. That some people, even when they go low, it's better than some other people who even have reached high in their for their for their level of Iman. Just because of a lack of knowledge or a lack of practice and or what have you, all of those various circumstances that uh, make the uh, make us make us different as individuals and our and make our Iman different. But listen to this hadith of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam which should give us a little bit of hope and it illustrates for us the fact that we all have sin. Qala alayhi salatu wasalam Kullu Kullu ibn Adam khatta wa khayran khattayin tawabun All the children of Adam alayhi salatu wasalam make sins but the best of those who sin is those who repent letting us know we all make sins and the best of all of us which is those sinners that pool of, of people committing sins is those who repent who make toba to Allah who come back to Allah who cry to Allah who beg Allah and feel sadness for what they did and determined to remove themselves from the sin that they committed. Those are the best. And the best of those who sin is those who repent. So that door, Ayu al Habba, is open. And I'd. Usikum wa nafsi bi taqwullah And I advise you and myself to fear Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And how do we fear Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? We do what Allah commands us to do and we avoid what He uh, prohibits us from. And we ask Allah the Almighty to bless us with ilm nafi, ruskan tayyib, wa amlan mutaqabbilan. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyana Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.